Hello everybody, my name is Mo. This is my channel, Fancy Mo. And Happy New Year, guys. 2016 is about to end. 2017 is around the corner. And I'm so happy this year is almost over. What most people do around this time is look back on what they did throughout the year. There was successes for people, fails for people. Good things happen, bad things happen, a bunch of things happen throughout this year. And what I kind of want to do for this video is do a top 10 video because not only it showcases what we did as a channel and what was the top 10 videos of my channel throughout this year, but it's also kind of like a countdown, if you will, like, you know how New Year's has a countdown until 12? This is a countdown of to my best video. So I thought this was a cool idea to do for New Year's Eve. So yeah, these are the top 10 fancy memo videos. There will be a playlist of not only the top 10 videos, but the honorable mentions too. So yeah, let's start off with the honorable mentions. And the first one will be probably my first video. That is literally what is called my first video. Hello everybody, my name is Memo, and this is my first video on Fancy Memo. My brand new channel. And it's just me talking about what I'm gonna do on this channel, what my plans are, and watching it back, I haven't changed even though it's been less than a year since I've started, but like, all I wanted to do is make other people laugh, make me happy, make other people happy. That's all I wanted to do on this channel. That's what I said in that video. And hopefully I'm doing a good job. Maybe it's like a humble, humble video trailer for my channel. I don't know why I didn't put it as my video trailer, but basically is one. Next on the honorable mentions is Bales and Other Awesome Stuff Compilation. My... Oh wait, no, I already have some. What does this do? Wait. Again, I'm sorry for being so bad at this game. I'm... Oh, it's like a grenade. And I killed myself. <laughs> this is probably my favorite video I've ever made. The editing, like this was early Fancy Memo videos. Like one of the first videos I made. The editing was pretty pretty good for a beginner. It's me playing Star Wars Battlefront and a bunch of fails and like funny stuff that I did while playing and I absolutely love that video. It didn't get a lot of views or anything but like I extremely love this video. It's like very natural if you know what I mean like some videos I feel like uh, I'm just like trying too hard or like I'm trying enough. That one it's all me. It's I'm not trying to be somebody, I'm not trying to be funnier than I really am, it's just me and I absolutely love it. And the editing makes it even better and funnier. I really really recommend it. And to round off the honorable mentions is Lilith's first soccer game. This is a video of Lily's first soccer game kind of, it but in like a mixtape form, like what actual soccer players or other athletes get. This was like Lily's version. She absolutely loves it. That's why I put it in here because it's her favorite video. Now let's start with the actual top 10 videos. And for number 10, it is a Challenge Famous YouTuber Edition. My name is Leafy and I wish I was grade A Andre. <laughs> the HUD challenge was like a big thing at the time. It like died off fast, but like it was pretty big at the time. And I thought it would be a good idea to do a YouTuber version. I was surprised how like not a lot of people did it. I was expecting a lot of people doing a YouTuber edition of the HUD challenge, but not a lot of people did, which was surprising to me. I'm not gonna lie, it wasn't my proudest video. I didn't really like it as much as the other videos, but it did really, really well for what I made. So yeah, that was number 10, and number 9 is Halloween Vlog. Kit Kats. You got Kit Kats? Yeah. You have to share. You want something? Uh, no thank you Abby, but thanks. This is basically what the title tells you. It was me vlogging Halloween. It's me spending time with my sisters. What we did throughout that day. We went to the park. We decorated our house. We obviously trick-or-treated. And there's like a bottle flipping contest in the vlog. And it's really funny. I recommend watching it. I love making 
all my videos. I love I love making reaction videos, game videos, but vlogging videos I absolutely love because not only like it's easier to make, but instead of focusing my time on trying to make it even funnier with my edits, I can focus my time on making it like more artsy, more professional looking with my edits. And that's what I tried to do with that vlog. And I actually really like that vlog. And I really like all my vlogs actually. If you guys have never seen a vlog of mine, please watch a couple of mine. It's pretty good, it's decent. I'm no Casey Neistat or anything, but it's decent. Alright, for number eight, it's happy birthday Tia. This was kind of like a gift to Tia because I couldn't get her a present and like actually give it to her since so she like moved and now she's like a little farther away and I can't drive so I can't drive over to her house and give her a present so what I did instead was make a last minute video for her. It showcases all the funny things she's done on my channel and video message from me and my sisters. She really loved that video and I'm so happy that you guys in the comments said happy birthday to her even though she's not like in every video of mine but she is part of the Fancy Memo family and you guys said happy birthday to her which was really nice and I really appreciate you guys for that. That video did really well. It got over a hundred views which is really really good for me. I don't get a lot of views and she absolutely loved that video so yeah thank you guys. Number 7, Las Vegas vlog. Again, I absolutely love my vlogs. I think I do a great job on my vlogs, and this is no exception. This was a great vlog of me and my family, basically mostly my sisters, having a great time at Vegas. We played games, we walked around, we went to cool buildings, we looked at cool stuff, we played Pokemon Go. <laughs> Remember when that was a thing? And it also got over 100 views, which is really, really good for me. For number six on our list, we've got Bean Boozle number three. Okay, ready? Set. Go! Go. This is one of my favorite videos that I've made. It's me, my sisters, and Tia all on one couch doing a challenge. It's our first challenge as a group together, and it was really funny. A bunch of gagging <laughs> because you know it's being boozled. It's like it's nasty if you've ever played it. You hear my sister running to the bathroom gagging, and I didn't know at the time, but that was actually her throwing up. <laughs> well, that's what she told me, and the end is also really hilarious. I was like running around. If you guys haven't seen it, I'm not gonna spoil it. You can just watch it. But it's really entertaining. It's one of my favorites. Number five, Ruby Rage Town of Salem. I am evil. Lynch me. <laughs> He's probably that's, the Joker. Yeah, that's, come on, get your sack. This is kind of my first gaming video with another person. And that other person is my sister Ruby. We decided to play Town of Salem because we love playing Town of Salem together. And I thought we should just record it. And it was really funny. It got intense at the end. If, if you never played Town of Solemn, check out my video. It's really funny. It's like kind of a mystery game and it gets intense at the end. It's Ruby's favorite video and my friend Proxy's favorite video. Shout out to Proxy. It's really good and really funny at the end. You guys should totally watch it. Number four. Thank you for 60 subscribers. Hello, my name is Mel. This is my channel, Fancy Mel. Thank you guys, thank you so much for 60 subscribers. I don't know if you guys know this, but how I got like somewhat of good following is because of shoutouts. And this was like one of the biggest shoutouts I've gotten. It helped me get 60 subscribers. At first I was gonna do a 50 subscribers special, 
but so many people started subscribing that I had to do a 60 subscriber special instead. This video was just me. Thank you guys for subscribing. Even though it's been less than a year, it showed how like I really like doing this, not just because I want fame or anything, because I don't actually really want fame on, off of YouTube. Like at most, I would like a hundred thousand subscribers, which is a lot, but it's not like the big YouTubers like a million subscribers. I want to lay low. I don't want to be extremely famous. And I probably will never be extremely famous. I already have plans for the future. YouTube is not gonna be my job, I, that's for sure. But, sidetrack aside, this was just me thanking you guys for subscribing. What I said in that video is absolutely true. I really like thank you guys and love you guys for everything you guys done for me. It's a nice video, it's a nice video. Number three on the list is, I'm so bad at this game, so there we go. I play this game, but not like, Ooh, ooh. It's when Slotherio was a big thing. This is a video that like kind of blew up on my channel. Like, I um, don't mean like billion like, views, like blowing up. I mean like we got 75 views, which is a lot for my channel. And in this video, it showcases me being bad at video games. You know, the funny stuff. It showed how bad I was in that game. And a little secret to you guys. I was playing that game in my pajamas and nobody noticed. So yeah, it was kind of funny. And that video did really well. I got a lot of support. It was very funny. You guys will enjoy it. Number two, all we're getting so close to number one, Whisper Challenge. Okay, I think I got it. Switch. People. Don't say it. Baby cheese curls. <laughs> 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 Do you get it? Baby cheese curl. <laughs> Lena, what was the word? Lemon. 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 Oh, you got the baby cheese curl. <laughs> As I said earlier, Tia doesn't really live around here anymore. So, but when she does visit, we try to make a bunch of videos as much as we can and this is a video that we did with her it was a whisper challenge and like kind of how Markiplier did it the game of telephone and whisper challenge combined it's very entertaining very very funny and yeah that was number two and the number one video on my channel is reacting to cringy musically videos <laughs> So this is when Musical.ly was kind of big, but making a video on cringy Musical.ly was even bigger. And I thought I should try to if like everybody else is doing it, so why not me? So that's what I did. I did the cringy Musical.ly video. I watched a bunch of cringy Musical.ly videos. And just like the fail video, it wasn't me trying to be too funny. I'm not trying to be somebody else. I was trying, uh, I wasn't trying at all. I was just being myself. Whatever I did was what I actually wanted to do. That video did so well. It was my best video for a long time, like most viewed, and had the most watch time like for so long. A lot of comments. Oh, and that was also the time when I got this big shout out. So a bunch of people came in. They like really enjoyed that video. People were so supportive. People liked it like crazy. Like. It's rare for me to get over 10 likes, and I got like 16 or something like that, around that. So that video did really, really well. You guys gave it so much support, so thank you. And yeah, that was my top 10 fancy memo videos. Again, I'm gonna make a playlist of all the top 10 videos and the honorable mentions. And you can watch it now if you'd like, or wait till I'm done talking and push that button on the end screen. So yeah. I really recommend you watching all of them. It's It sounds conceited coming from me since I actually made the videos, but it's really good videos. You guys won't be disappointed. And it showcases like how well I did throughout the year, how how much I improved on editing, on like talking from the camera, on so many things that I've improved on throughout the year. So you can see me like grow kind of like what the growth I've done throughout the year. And I wish I could put a lot more videos. There's videos like Saving My Senpai, both of my I Am Bread videos, my other vlogs, 
even some of like the newer videos like really reacting to her video message from Santa and like my Christmas haul thing like what I got for Christmas and what my sisters got for Christmas. There's a lot of videos I liked and I hope you guys liked a lot of my videos. So yeah, I do recommend checking out that playlist and watching all of those videos and again please tell me what were your favorite videos that I made and or what were your favorite videos that were made in 2016. Like you don't have to put my your favorite video from me if you don't want to. You can put your favorite video of like your favorite YouTuber or something. And also just because I'm kind of curious what are you doing today like for New Year's and everything. I would love to know down in the comments below. So yeah, thank you guys for a wonderful, wonderful year. Thank you guys for, for the support, um, for the love, for being supportive of my like little fancy my whole family. Thank you guys for your open arms for my like sisters and my friend Tia. You guys are very supportive, you guys are very kind, you guys are great people and I love you guys for it. And hopefully 2017 will be a better year for all of us. Well, it can't get worse than 2016. But hopefully it's an even better year for us. I have a bunch of videos planned. I've been working hard throughout my break making videos. I have a bunch of video ideas and I hope you guys still stay watching my videos, still support me, still comment, still like, and this is like our journey together, our YouTube journey. Maybe someday we'll get big, probably not, but who knows, anybody can get big on YouTube. Just It's just a matter of how determined you are, how hard, how hard working you are, and how lucky you are. So again, thank you guys for a wonderful year. Please like, comment, and subscribe if you haven't. And yeah, see you in the next year. I love you guys. Good. Bye.